Hello and welcome all. In today's session, we will learn how to set icon and title of a web page. And remember, we are creating the Django website. So we'll use Django and Python to create the websites. So what are the steps? Step number one, we need to create a Django project. We have already done this in the uh, previous session. Then we need to create the Django template. We have already done this uh, in the previous session. We need to create the static folder and store icon images there so that uh, we can access these images. We have already done this step also. And in today's uh, session, we will start with the step number four, assuming that we have already done all these steps uh, previously. So we have done these in the previous sessions. So step number four is to load static on the web page. So uh, we have already created one uh, project. You can see this is our Django project. Inside the Django project, we have created the templates and let's say the index.html template. So uh, I'll click on this index.html template. So this is the index.html template. So step number four, we need to load static in this template. So uh, on the top of this, what I'll do is I'll write the code to load static. So I'll load static. So this is how I can load a static folder inside the template. Now step number five, we'll go inside the header tag and use the title tag to specify the web page title. So this is the head tag. I can go inside the head tag and anywhere in the head tag, I can specify this uh, title tag. And let me write my first title and icon. So I have given this title to the web page. This is my first title and icon. So this is step number uh, step number five through which we can set the title of a web page. Now step number six to add the icon in the title bar, the small icon we see on the top left corner in the title bar. As you can see here, uh, we also have an icon here on the notepad. This is the title and this is the icon. Similarly, we have on the web page. So just to set that icon, first of all, we need to have the icon inside our project. So inside the project, we have already created this a static folder and inside the static folder, we have this image folder. And inside this image folder, we have our images or we can also paste any uh, icon here. For that, we can go to the, let's let me right click and uh, I can copy the path. I'll copy the absolute path. I'll open uh, this PC and inside the address bar, I'll paste the path. So you can see this is still images. I'll hit enter and here these are the images I already have. So you can paste any image from uh, you can download from Google. You can create your own icon and you can paste it here inside this images folder. So I'll use this uh, banner or I can use this uh, stone. Any image I can use to just to show you the icon. So I'll use this banner. It, it is an advice that you should use a very small sized image that will look like an icon. So now let me use this uh, for a while banner banner dot uh, it's JPG. So I need to go inside the head tag and just below the title tag, I'll use link tag. So this is the link tag. I need to specify the attribute REL and inside this I'll specify icon. So I'll specify icon and then I need to specify the hyper reference. So just to specify the hyper reference, I need to use static and then I need to specify the path. I need to write static correctly. So this is a static and then I need to specify the path in the single quotes. So the path here, you can see it's inside images and then banner.jpg. So I'll write images and then inside I have banner.jpg. Now I need to close this tag. 
and I need to close this uh, link tab as well. So in this step, we have specified link tab. Inside the link tab, we had two attributes, REL and HREF. The HREF uh, attribute will specify the location of the icon. Uh, this can be any icon image or any normal image as well. Uh, the ICO extension images are preferable here in case of the icon. But you can use any .jpg or PNG, any image can be used. A small sized image is preferable. Now I need to run this, so I'll go to the terminal. I'll change the directory, my Django site, and then I'll use python manage.py run server. Can see the server is running i'll click on the server url and here you can see inside the title bar so this is the title my first title and icon and this is the icon i have used so you can see this is the bigger image but here it's 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 looking pretty small because it's the icon so that is why i have suggested that you should use a small icon image so this is how we can add title and uh, icon to the web page using the Django and Python.